And welcome back to Zelda 2 Resurrection of Ganon. We are picking up at the starting location because we got screwed over in, in this palace here. And apparently I have no idea where to go. So we will give this place another go and hopefully find the way forward. And keep in mind that if there is a solid door like this one, do not, I repeat, do not use fairy. Maybe this is required just for this door, who knows, but no, just don't. Unless there's a dead end. Is there a dead end here? I recall there being something that caused me to go back. I don't remember what's on this side. Can ignore it. Yeah, oh, I've been here and I went back. Good. Nope. Bye. Now, uh, left maybe? No, oh, there's another door. Silly fire ghost. Huh? Oh, yes, yes, that's, that's fine. That's right. Both of them had nothing on their sides, but that means there's nowhere to go. Unless there might be one place to go. Let's head back to the starting area. And there I will try to fly through the western door because flying through this one led to sadness and pain. Oh, that was a very, very nice jump. First try, even. So, I think this is the initial location. No, you don't. Yep, that's the initial location. I need to remember that I don't need to uh, go into the spells list to, to recast a spell. Because every time you wanted to cast a spell in original, you would have to open this menu, cast the spell. And even if you would want to recast the same spell, you would need to open, close the menu, and recast. That was annoying. At least that's the version I remember. Okay, we got screwed over! Yay! So... There's no way to progress in this palace until I will find the final key. And the final key is... No idea. Honestly, no idea. I need to think of every location that I can. Ghosties. Hmm. Sadness and pain. I could just... Re Honestly, I could just reload the save state, but... I did get some decent experience while exploring this area again. Oh, goddammit. You see, it's a very bad habit of reopening the menu unless... Nah, there's nothing here. <laughs> also, I... Random thought. This would be a great game to actually stream instead of doing a weekend uh, let's play. <sighs> I need to get back to streaming eventually. But that's... Probably months, if not years, from now on. Dash. Now, where do I need to go? Oh yes, I said that I have an idea of a single place. Which is a strong, very strong, maybe. First of all, I want to find out if there's something in, in here. I know that I did not have... Yet yeah, there is a palace there! Oh! Guys, there's water around it. <laughs> hey, that's progress! That's sadness and progress both at the same time! I want to see where this cavern leads to. Because this would be normally the way that you would enter. 
um, this this palace with the help of the fairy spell. So I'm curious on how it works now. Oh, oh, life container, excellent, very nice. I'm happy that I checked it out because I know that I fell down in, in, in the southern part of the of the cemetery and there was no entrance to the palace so this either was a dead end to the point of game crash or whoa or it had to have some sort of an item very cool a torn down knight screw you buddy actually that's what i wanted so yeah it's fine very cool through the palace entrance. The tile is from... from the fourth palace or the fifth palace? One of those. So we are doing very well. This is where we should be now. I assume master key in this, in, in this location. And then in final palace we will get the flute. No. Nope. Really? The game ex okay. I thought that the game would expect me to go all the way around it. Grab that key back. And I will be annoyed if that's a 50. That's a 500. I I uh, I do feel a lot better now. Thank you, game. That was kind of you. And since we are reaching the Final attack level. I think final. It will be obvious when I reach 6000 because life level up right now was 6000. So if magic is 6000, that means 8 is still, is still the last one. But once again, the original had final uh, levels at. I mean, above the final levels was, were at 9000. So this version is a lot more forgiving when it comes to that. Since this is attack, I ooh, this looks unique. Kill this guy, uh, guard. Yep, everything, everywhere is six thousand. So level eight magic, uh, level eight attack should be eight thousand, while everything about uh, ab above level eight should be nine thousand. And that would only grant extra life. Nothing else. Well, extra life and recharge on whatever it is, magic or life. So while we have maxed maxed out levels, you are no longer. You don't really need to take mm, the attack. It's a lot better to take either life or magic. Oh no! What the? So, wait, what? What now? Game, this is not funny. Game. The spell is not destroying them. Fire is not destroying them. I don't think dash would matter here. It's not Super Metroid that you can just turbo dash against things. Yeah, there's... Whoa. I have no idea what, what to do now. Mm. Let's see if there's any fake floors. I'm so screwed. I think I said that there's something still that I can try out. Maybe. There's probably nothing here. Nope. Nope. And I will not repeat myself for the next 50 blocks. Oh, that's right. I could potentially. Yep. This needs to be timed pretty well. There we go! 
silly game and its silly secrets. This I knew that there had to be a secret. There are there was it was not possible that there would be no secrets in this area, since I couldn't recall a single way to move forward. Sure. God damn it. One more time. Just breathe. This game is just taking a piss out of you. That's normal. We played wars. It could be Adventure Island bullshit. Okay, so definitely not this room. Screw you, buddy. Okay, it was the next room, right? Now, the room after this, maybe? God damn it. So it's somewhere here, where the this is lower. Yeah, so I assume it's here. Exactly. The whole thing was... That's the... Well, I cannot say the whole thing was fake, but that was the... Uh, what's it called again? That was the indicator that there's something wrong here, because those blocks were lower than they should be. A lift that goes up and reaches dead end. Yay! Do I have any keys? I do not. Mm. Screw you. Not gonna die in this silly place again. Yeah, this is one of those from, from the original that... Hey! That was extremely lucky that I needed the fairy here. Yeah, one of those uh, places that you could you couldn't cast a fairy because that would screw you over. See, so many slimes. That means something fishy going on here. Yes, yes, yes! The final key. We are done with casting fairy to get past a door lock. Now, there is no door that remains untouched. No, that, sound, that sounded better in my head. Wait, no, it didn't. Oh well. I should have cast a fairy. One other thing that I seem to briefly recollect from my memory. I do recall that there was a way to get over 10 keys without opening the required required doors. How? Basically, finding the keys and dying and restarting. I know that I placed that challenge upon myself back in, in the kids days on, on the actual NES. And I don't know if I recall it correctly, but I seem to recall that collecting 10 keys, of course, uh, the obvi obvious thing was it turned the counter from 9 to A, as in hex, hex, hexadecimal. So A means 10, from A to F, which F means 15. Badly, since I know they carry over. And um, once it reached A, you were given a free, and I do mean it, a free uh, master key. Instead of collecting collecting it at, uh, at nearly the game's end, you were given it very early, which was weird. Oh, now, now that I see this room, I think the tile set is actually correct, from, from the correct palace. Oh well. The thing that I'm curious about here now is, why are we given the full mana recharge? Yeah, so I 
you do seem to recall that you could get a final key before reaching the, the final palace. Well, the final part of the game. Maybe that's wrong. I don't know. Maybe I may. There's also a chance that I did avoid any of the locked rooms. That I went into Death Mountain without the torchlight. Hey, I don't care about keys. Screw you. Whoa. No, you don't. Yeah, I went into the Death Mountain without uh, the light source. I, w I do recall I was able to complete it with some serious issues, but I was able to complete it. it took me way too many times. Victory! I see. BS game is BS until the very end. Yeah, I was able to complete uh, that mountain without the, uh, the candle, which is a feat. And then I was able to start collect. I did not collect a single key until I got the final key. That's how much effort I placed in, in this. If you are in for a challenge, you can surely try it out. I did it definitely on the original NES, so if you're up to it, then go ahead, no save states, and try it. I think that's one of the biggest challenges I did with, with the game. Get the final key without a single usage of a key. There's also a chance that you had to conserve your uh, extra lives. Mm, to know where you would need the extra life to get through a lock. That's a very slim chance. I don't recall that. That being an actual thing, so I don't know. Uh, let's head east, uh, west first. West, okay. Why? Sneezing, think, stuff. Why? Why did I see the cursor on screen for a brief moment? I don't know. I, I apologize. Oh, this was a dead end. Yes, I did say, my wife, bless you. All in Polish, don't worry. Yeah. Pay attention to the game. <laughs> now, this place will be a breeze. But basically, this is the... Maybe re reincarnation of the sixth palace from the original, since you need the master key to proceed. Both right sides went to the forest like area. So. I should be fine now. I did see that item room, and I still remember there's a pitfall down there, which I will cast jump. Surely I will. I don't know. Let's go down. This place will give me the final. Well, not only the final mana container, but also. Yeah, this will be the mana, right? Oh no, not yet. Maybe? Oh, blocks blocks at the end. I recall. Uh, yeah, we will receive the, the seventh mana container that we pick up. And the final item, which is the flute. That means... We will be heading towards the final palace in the next couple of minutes. 10, 15, maybe 20. Oh! Oh! Yeah, interesting that there was no gem here. Oh, cool! This is the... The room... How do you call that? The room gimmick from, uh, from the Death Mountain. I like this. That you, you implement it in the palace. Whoa! A hey boss! 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 First boss! What the hell am I even fighting here? Ah! An undead giant thing. I don't know its name in the original, so yeah, I have no idea what it's called here. It's as easy as it was there. Just wait for it to appear in the center. Maybe not. You're dead. Bye. 
Yay! Our first boss! 1000! Very cool. And also the gimmick with the game. If there's a boss encounter, that's a 100% key drop. Yes! Final mana container! And I do think that this mana container actually restores more magic. Uh, it doesn't. Okay, never mind. Maybe it restores up to uh, I up to eight uh, mana squares. I don't know how to even call it because I know that it does restore m more than you can have maximum when you have less than ma than eight. If that makes sense. <sighs> Nice, a secret boss was a very good secret. So this should allow me to enter the final palace. Even though we still need... What the... Oh, I see. That's so weird. No, 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 no. Good. I still need the item from this place. No, you don't. Nope. Close one. Yeah, another dead end. So I assume this will be the crystal again. So 1000 experience, maybe. Yep. Why is there a hole here? Ah, uh, life. Yep, 8 is the maximum, and I did get the extra life, so... Okay, I see. The game messes up with you by placing the gem here and no gem there, so if you're not careful, if you're not... Uh, if you don't put the attention to it that... Or at least you don't remember that the game can pull so, such BS as secrets out the least expected places and you just wander this place for quite a while but since we've got all our stats at 8 all of the containers at maximum all we need to do now is find the last <sighs> find the last container and uh, the item and GTFO really, really want to GTFO from this place. And since we are getting quite near the end of the game, this is surely the last video, or I hope that this will be the last video, as it was commented on, you, on, on the first or the second video that you guys did not expect that uh, I could play Zelda 2 for, for the NES. I do occasionally play NES games on, on this channel and I am I had an urge to play an NES, uh, NES game uh, for for some time. But you? Go down here. Actually, one second. Will it mute the game? It did not mute the game. Very good. So, I need to check one thing. Just, just to be sure. No, no, no. And here. Yes, Miroslav, I am talking about you at this point. Thank you for uh, for bringing up that. Uh, that I played uh, a game that was unexpected to, uh, <laughs> to be played. I did play the original here as well, but I think that might have been one of the first ones I uh, I played on the, on the channel, so that was also a challenge. But I am really interested in playing uh, NES games here. Not only for, for this, maybe for some lighter titles. And I don't mean Gradius or Life Force, because those are a killer. I played Life Force, I tried uh, Gradius, but that game is just too hard. I I wouldn't be able to beat it with uh, without save states. There's the flute! Oh, secret! Excellent. I like that the game shows those. Interesting. 
Pretty cool. So I was... Oh, I see. I think. Yeah, there was this place and I think I went straight down. Anyway, yeah, so... Talking about... Uh, Zelda. I do intend to play some more NES games. It was usually done. I usually done a uh, Wednesday, so wet NES day. I think on on the channel itself. It, I did feel it went pretty well. I do still have some of the NES games in my collection. That I ah, there we go. Yeah, for tries tries the charm. I do still have some NES games that I really would like to play here. Definitely not Top Gun or Stealth. Those games were hard as they were. I don't think I would ever beat them. So far, all the games that I played here... Well, most... I think most of the games that I played on the channel for the, for the NES I do own, and... I think I've beaten every single one of them. At least here. In my collection, maybe there's two more that I have not beaten. Three. I have recently actually acquired two NES games for I believe that's quite cheap for for my local standards around $15 Let me quickly recalculate 15. Yeah, around 50 15 dollars uh, Just the bear game nothing else that was Star Tropics and Oh boy, I don't remember the other one it was an NES dungeon crawler. Grid based dungeon crawler for the NES, which just the sheer thought of it uh, is, makes me excited to play it. But if I decide to play another NES game in, in, in the near future, that would definitely be Star Tropics. I tried it out on, uh, on the actual console. I think the first one or two levels and then decided no this is actually a good game i want to play it so yeah if there will be any NES games that might be it wait what what are there now i want to know if i can walk on water here but yeah it does it does make slight sense I cannot walk on this I would need to cross the bridge. Yeah, but enough of, of the other games. I want to complete this. And oh boy, how it bugs my mind that I still need to do so many Amstrad uh, showcases. There were so many games that I played as far as I remember. I haven't tried, I haven't recorded all of them. And those are, for the Amstrad, those are only showcases, because as a kid, I never beaten, I think, any of them. And I do not expect to beat them right now. There was only a single Amstrad game that I've beaten on, on this channel. That, that was the Ground Zero. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think this is the shortcut. Maybe, maybe not. Two rooms of, of, of this cave. Maybe there was more games. I would love to play Boulder Dash for the Amstrad. That was a great game. And I think I I recall the third one better than the first one. Never played the second one. I did play Boulder Dash for for the NES. That was a very good game. I did own it for a very short period as a kid. I had good memories, and I even uh, I think. Have it on the retro pie. But retro pie is another topic. I did acquire uh, Pi Pi 400. Okay, uh, Pi 400 was a thing that I wanted to, to get for myself since I never owned any Raspberry Pis, and then. I noticed by 400. Hey, you need to wait three months for it. Uh, eh, eh. Every single time when I looked I looked for it, it was delay, delay, delay. And two, the only two shops in, in my country that sold those at December 20th were... Mm, mm, 
one of them was always delaying it. I think I, uh, if I would went with, with the first one that had more trust, I would end, end up with it. At that given point, in December, they said uh, March 2021. 20, uh, so, no, no. Most powerful magic. The power to resurrect. Wait, what? That's not resurrect. That was the power of thunder. Maybe thunder resurrects. Maybe the monster, the final boss, is a Frankenstein's monster that we need to thunderize to resurrect. Oh, who knows? Yeah, so yeah, Pi 400. Very cool. I learned quite a lot about it when I got it. And thanks to RetroPi, I even learned things that my wife did forget that she played as a kid, which is a surprisingly pleasant experience. Like, she she didn't own any, almost any consoles as a kid, maybe only the, the original Game Boy. And then she noticed the title, Castlevania. I was like, you play that? Yeah, it was hard. I sucked at it, but I played it and liked it. Gave her the controller and whoa. Yep. Both parts <laughs> checked out. Weird random ramble, but oh well. You never know what you can expect of, of your partner. Which is, I think, the most interesting thing about the whole thing thing. <sighs> yeah, I'm talking about that. Random things while being chased by deadly ghosts. Re trying to reach end game. I found the thunder spell, and there is hundred percent nothing in this location, in this town anymore. I could have just left and the city through through the other. That's a tall house. I could just left through through the other exit, but meh. Yeah. So Zelda Two: Resurrection of Ganon. Focus. We've got a resurrection spell. Let's go and resurrect him. It. The evil ghost thing. That went very well. There's a set encounter here, which seems to be the same. But there's a way to skip it because it's annoying. Just whoa. Just do that. And normally I would cast fairy to get out of this encounter, but it's okay. Uh, I think I missed a set encounter right after. Or maybe I didn't. Right after the spider flute thing. But there's one here. Maybe not. That part. One, two. Oh, there it is. Yay, pee bag. A 500 pee bag. One more set encounter here. Yep. Just wait to avoid it. Or actually, let's go through it. Oh, that was good. very good. Screw you, ghosties. Screw you. Screw you. Screw you. And you can just fly above. Whoa. This requires a dash or jump. Screw that thing. No one. No, oh, that that went well. Did I see a spider there? Whoa. What the? That was so weird. Ah, now we need the mana. I'm certain I saw this, the flute spider. Oh, it's life here. I, yeah, that's what I heard. Scorpion. Oh, screw you, buddy. And the blue thingy, yep. If the game wants to mess up with you, mess with you, rather. They will just throw those guys now. Yeah, there's a spider in the center. One more set encounter here. Since we already know what those are, I'll just skip it. <sighs> yeah, I could never speedrun this game. I don't know the mechanics for uh, for set encounters. Well, how to move to have them walk the way you want them to go. Something, something. Speedrun strats. No! 
I should have cast that guard. Ah, let's do that. The good thing, at least on the original, is that is that once you reach the final palace, which is the spider location, you will restart from there. But I think the Famicom Famicom version of this game also allows you to restart from, from the given palace. Yeah, yeah, screw that. I'm checking if there are any extra secrets here, because you never know. Nope. Now that I see Spider here, does that mean the final boss will be Spider Mastermind? Like Doom 1 style? This scared me. In the original, the, the, this barrier requires you to uh, put in all of the stones, as we have zero here, in, in all six palaces before you can get access. But. I'm thinking, thinking hard. I know that as a kid, I was able to cheese the barrier somehow. Whether it was shield, fairy, thunder, spell, spell thing. But I did some insane combo and managed to fly through the barrier and survive. Normally it's an insta kill, but here just worked. Whoa. Oh, so we are throwing some ballsy things at me, eh? I'm just gonna ignore the enemies. Because... I will go... Yep. Uh, the usual path that leads towards the end of the palace. I might still recall it. Left, right, right, left. If I go through the lifts. That's, that's what I remember. Of course, it may not be correct, but if this is the final palace, it may still follow the same rules. I don't like that there are no enemies. Knights with throwing knives, swords. No, still this guy. That's fine. Yes, yeah, screw you, buddy. Blocks, yes, blocks. Good. Okay, single heads. Oh, no! Now, enemy here. No enemies. There should be a quite annoying enemy here, but since he's not here, I'm not gonna complain. Nope. Thank you. Yeah, you're too quick. There he is. No, no. Big ball. Yeah, the big ball. If you hit it once, nothing happens. If you hit it multiple times, it splits into smaller ones. Oh! He took enough hits. Interesting. They take as many hits as the original, but they give less experience, which is also annoying. Secret. Yes. So, not much changed. This statue can have both, I think it can have both, or maybe none. The magic and the knight, I'd rather leave it alone. Maybe it was here. Jump. See, nothing. Screw you. It should give total zero experience, and so it did. I killed it quickly, which means the other one I nearly killed. Yeah, I nearly killed the other one. Whoa, 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 no, 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 screw you, screw you. Mm. No, the giant slime. Did not expect that. I'd rather use shield for you. Pretty cool. Yes, 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 no. Yep, the giant slime turns into small slimes. Because reasons. Pretty cool. And there should be the sword knife throwing dude here. Nope, the fire 
throwing thing. Three, four, four, five, six. Nice. And the flame ghost grant only five experience. That's very little. Of course, you wouldn't be able to tell that this w would crumble. You need to fall down. It's only because I recalled this room. Mm -hmm. Yep, the long curtain room. Curtains. So close. This room is nothing like the original. It should have several of those big balls that fall, uh, turn into small ones. Yep, that's normal. All this room is. Run! Secret. Yep. I have not checked the right side wall. Maybe? No. It, I think it's a 50-50 chance for this guy to, to be a suit farmer. Now, on the right there was a fairy, on the left there was an extra life. Let's see how original this room is. I could have actually went for the secret, uh, for the extra life first. But I will fairy just in case. Or prepare the fairy just in case. Very good slime. Yeah, there's the extra link. I, that room is if you reach one of the incorrect paths. Fear the mighty Link, run away from him. Jump into your oblivion doom thing. Now left. This should lead to, this this room type should be the last one that we see. If we will see another one like this with lift both sides. I went the wrong way. Which Interesting, that's new. Oh, I think I might have went the wrong way. All right, so this changed. I should be I should be getting near the bottom room. But actually, the tiles here actually made me feel a bit uneasy. Like they were mixing together, I think. Not motion sickness like, but similar, I think. Yeah, I am totally in the wrong spot now. I assume that the Ganon's lap was. God damn it. The Ganon's lap was because of that. It's not the right path to take. I'll do one more check before I go back. Dude, you need to die. I wanted to see if there's a way to go down. I know that he did not fall, but there are blocks that cannot be destroyed. Uh, that has to be destroyed before you will even try. But no, mm, this is not the place. So I need to go back. Maybe I need to go to the opposite ways. Totally opposite. I cannot go left. There's nothing on the sides here. Nothing on the right side. And back here. Can I even get up here? I don't know. Yeah, I don't think I can get up here without without jump spell. That would suck. Oh screw you. You only take two or hits anyway. I'm trying to think where else can I go. Whoa. Yeah, screw that. Maybe I need to go towards the left side wall. Nothing here. Definitely not. 
I should be fine. I am fine. The very last moment. No, 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 no. Yeah, that's, that was too late. <sighs> Two more attempts. Guard. This is how the shield spell should be in the original. Yeah, I need to select something. Magic! And I will drop... Yep. I drop on the flame. I should have known that. The game will mess up with me. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Yay, extra life, by the way. That I picked up from, from the experience. Secret? Now I'm... Now I will be checking most of the walls for secrets. I don't think there will be one up here by the armor. I hope not. The game did not prepare me for such. Yes, those slimes are insanely hard compared to normal ones and give only, only 10 experience. Maybe there was gun on laughter if I when I went the wrong way. I don't know. I wasn't listening. It's not a dead end, which is good. Jump. Secret? No. Okay, we are back here, which might be good, because there should be now the knife sword throwing dude. Yep, guard. Life? Come on. Just jump. One more. Maybe two more. God damn it. I hate those guys. Can't, can't really tell when they will jump. It, they are... One of the hardest enemies in the game, in my opinion. Hmm. And when they jump, you need to... You need to place your shield in the appropriate position. I think I know how. No, wait, no, I don't know. I don't know where I need to go. Okay, this looks more like it. The heads. Yeah, that's... This looks like a screw you room. Hey, kill, kill. Pretty good. Again? This is totally different. So close. Secret? Okay, only on one side. Should I try jump? Nothing here. Come on. Yes. I will gladly reheal. Since the resurrect spell only costs 64, which means I need I need four full squares of magic containers. Looks weird. No, 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 no. Yeah, I wondered when I will eventually le le get here and it will lead me to. No, this is a different room. Okay. Make sure to check every single floor. Wait, what? I'm certain I checked every single one. I need to access from the other side. That's good. At least I need to jump over a single one. Fairy. 
good. Still sane. There was a room like this in the original. People, people that don't know the actual path through, through the final palace wouldn't know. Well, would know, rather, because you can easily stumble upon those. God damn it. I assume that's the bad thing. <sighs> Kill. Too many paths that I can take. I'm not even sure where, where I am anymore. Ew. This is totally different. I probably took the, the wrong turn at the very, very beginning of, uh, of the area. Nothing. Yeah, this room is also different. I don't recall such room. The reason why I am killing them is to find if there's any, like, drop tile. Ew. Mana? Sure. Easy so far. No, whatever. For a second, God damn it. for a second, I thought he is protecting a secret passage. I don't like that those rooms are now rearranged. Fairy. Nothing. Wow, I got stuck on a fairy. That was weird. No, no, and no. Bye. He is so quick. Next, where do I... I feel so lost in in this palace now. It feels like my first time here. Again, a fairy? Sure. No secrets. Oh, I did not get stuck on the fairy. It's it was the animation that the Link would do when he would collect the fairy, which is the just the spark link. Oh, I hear you. Oh, get the guard. Two, three, four, five, six. Ha! Huh. You will not escape me. Okay, this is also new. Very nice. Very cool. This is totally out of this palace. However it sounds, totally out of this place. I don't know if I want to go this way. Let's check out the other way. Maybe it is correct, but I don't know. Maybe. Five, 
six. There's a way down. I don't think I want to go down just yet. Okay, I might want to go down. But if you... <laughs> okay, never mind. Uh, the game's just taking a piss out of me. Sure, sure game. I cannot, dis cannot destroy those blocks. Invisible. Nearly forget about you. And I do want to complete the game in this video. I will not prolong it any longer. Prolong any longer or whatever. I don't want to make it. Uh, I don't want to make any more videos. This should be the final one. We are so close. To be honest, I still don't know if we are heading the right way. Link, stop getting blocked. Very good. Run away. Says run away. Almost, almost there, I hope. I've got no idea where to go now. This seems like at least to the game start zone. I mean, not the game start, the palace start. It's all about the exploration, yes I know. It will lead to the dual win. Yes, dual elevator area. Now the question is, is it the first one or is it the second one? I might be able to tell. I'm not able to tell. If I came from the left side, but went up and did not exit, that means that's the second. Because if this would be the uh, left is... Wait, left should be the correct way. This will lead to the start, right? Yes, at least to the start. <sighs> Let me think. Le right? Right? Uh, right? So I, into, I went left. Maybe I need to go left and then right. Or right and then left, left and right. There's no monster here, that means... There... Ah, this is a different one. Hmm. Sorry. God damn it, game. Stop throwing fireballs at me! Yes, yes, it's all good. Dead end, right? God damn you, game. I need to go left, but I tried that already. <sighs> I'm trying to think, what did I miss? Apart from falling down at that one certain place. left then left again is not the right way maybe left right left right yes left right left right sounds uh, ac uh, accurate because I went I went left right right left and that was bad so the, the final left I changed into right and that got me into a different place so left, right, then left again. Okay. That may work. So this is a, a, the empty room. I'm actually getting tired of this music. I'm 
very good. No enemies here, almost. Two, three, four, five, six. Bye. I need to jump up there. Maybe there's a secret. No. This should be an easy room to get through now. Oh. I thought that it was only one hit to kill it. <sighs> Just making sure that there is no fake floor. Since the game cannot tell. Okay. Had to kill this one apparently. Mm, nothing on the left. I need to check the the left wall. Ah, wrong button. Nothing. And yes, this is the final place where I have to go. There is no other palace, no other town. I've got all of the spells. I've got all uh, of the items. So yeah. Screw you, buddy. Nothing. Left, right, left. I should start safe stating at, at this point for the sake of exploration and, and this playthrough. Only on, on those intersections. Or only when I will find that there's an FU place, like drop down. The enemies are here. Single slime twice. I must be getting tired. But if this is not the way, then I don't know what it is. Then I will need to poke at it at a different time. Like try out all of those pits. No. No, no, and no. Just no. Certain that I was already here. Yeah, I was here. Die. No. Nope. Aha! Survived. Whew. Close one. Lucky. 16, 32, 48. Very good. Nothing. Probably nothing here. There was that fairy before about. I probably took it already. I sure did. I should actually die somewhere to recharge magic and health. Yeah, I've been here. I do recall this area. Maybe. <sighs> oh yes, I do recall this place. Dude, kill me. I, I need my magics. You. Because I fell down before. First of all, let's explore with the fairy. I 
I've been on the other side already as well. Because that's where I fell down. And there's no other way around it. I think. Can I get above it? No. I wonder, there's a way to, to tease this. I'm gonna actually pause for a second and make a save state quickly. There we go, because I don't want to soft lock myself. Because I remember that if you jump, jump out of bounds, but I am not out of bounds. Yeah, I, I'm not jumping out of bounds, so it doesn't help. If I would jump out of bounds and turn into fairy, I could just fall down again, maybe. Yeah, that did not work. Ah, grumble, grumble, grumble. Where do I need to go? Maybe I went the, the right path in, in the first place. Also, is there a way to, to the right? No. That would feel wrong. I am so lost. I'm trying to think where else can I go? I covered all of the all of the areas. I've never tried to drop through those, but seeing that there's the the blood thing, the, the red thing, the water, lava, that would be a bad time. I've got no idea. And then the big thing screws me. Sure. But to be fair, those big sl slimes did appear in, in, in those rooms. So that at least that part is perfectly normal. Screw you. To be honest, I am clueless. no secret there. So where does this room lead to again? Jumping up. Nothing. Hmm. Let's grab that and try to go towards the usual path. I know that the, the, the laughing voice is there, but maybe it's only there to um, make fun of you, and that's it. Maybe there is a way forward. This guy re responds? That is totally unexpectable. Not what I wanted to do, but hey, somehow it worked out. tried to go towards right and that was a dead end. That was, I think, with the uh, fake floor. 
There's probably a single path that I did not take. <sighs> Let's return back to the starting point or whatever. Then I will do it the old-fashioned way, but probably off-screen. Like pen and paper. And map down every path that I take. Or rather paint, uh, Microsoft Paint and pen and paper. That also works. This should lead me to the split zone. It did. And this is not the... Maybe I need to go right twice. No. Left, right, right, left. That's how I went before. This is the empty bridge. I don't know. I am giving up at this point and I will try either to figure out something on in my spare time or tackle it at a different time because that's a bit too much for, for the time being. I would love to say hope that this was enjoyable to watch as much as I suffered for this but I don't think it was. But Sometimes watching the others suffer is enjoyable, you sadistic guys, you. So, you never know. Anyway, that's all for this video. Yes, hope you guys enjoyed it and see you in the next. Take care. So, yes, welcome back. I was exploring the final palace on, well, off screen, drawing an awesome map in Microsoft Paint of, of the paths that I am taking, and I stumbled back upon this area. Yes, I've been here, I am w well aware of that, but I've tried something a bit different than, than before. I fell down, which results in this place, which is of course understandable. Nothing new. I tried the walls, I tried the floor, nothing. I left the room. And then I went back in. And I'm in a different place. I don't like when the same rooms are not connected with each other. So, in my understanding, this is not the same. And I don't even know how I can um, map it down. And that's where I stopped off-screening, just to get back to, to this place. And I am boned. Maybe not. Slime? No slime. Mm -hmm. This is the normal place where I would want to go. I would... In the actual final palace I would want to go down, but do I want to go down here? I don't know. Yeah, let's go down. It should lead me to the same room as we were just a moment ago. Yes, it did. Uh, no. No, we don't. Slime. Yes. So this is the, the boss room. Should be the boss room. Which I should use to resurrect, but I don't have the map. Jay gone. Whatever, whatever game. Very good. I'm gonna cast guard just in case this guy will not want to die. Good. Oh, okay, so I do not cast resurrect here, I need to move on. <sighs> the next room is the original game final room. So it is here. Okay, let's ready for the let's get ready. Resurrect? <laughs> That's a doofy looking cannon. Cause this cast That's all Okay. It's basically Thunderbird. Okay. Come on, I need to hit you. The Thunderbird cannot be hurt by uh, down and up stabs. So I need 
to work him out. Two more hits and he should be done for and we might be... Yeah, that's it. We resurrected him and he died? Interesting. And he dropped a... Triforce? You saved Hyrule and you are a real hero. Yeah, that's a default ending, isn't it? I think. Guess. Yep. The end. So yeah. The thing that I was missing was just to leave it, leave the room and go back into it. And that's what screwed me over in, in the first place. Staff, Zelda 2 Resurrection of Ganon by GTM604. Interesting. Well, I did kind of figure that uh, since hacking CF207, since I did not get at the, la the Ganon's laugh at when I fell down into the pit, that something was probably wrong with it. So, yeah, if it wouldn't be for uh, the need to exit and re-enter the same room, it would, would have been, I think, a lot better if, if the final palace would have a twist to it, just take a different path, switch it over or, or something. It was switched slightly, but um, I've got mixed feelings at, at, uh, about the end of uh, of the game and i'm surprised that the final boss was basically the same thing that you just need to cast thunder-esque spell and kill it you did it i sure did go play rando by dick shake no idea what rando is i might look it up maybe probably not <sighs> is that it i pressed start we're back at the menu, so we died in total five times, lost all lives, and I think one or twice was it on purpose, just to get ourselves a quick restart from, from the very beginning instead of the second controller code, I think that's up arrow and start or whatever, it brings you to the continue save window on the second controller, yep. So yes, this was Zelda 2, Resurrection of Ganon. Hack, remake, remake, remaster, well, hack, yes, it's a hack. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I might consider some more NES games in, in the near future, as already explained in, in, in the video itself. Thank you for watching. Once again, hope you guys enjoyed it, and see you in the next. Take care.